Richard Lenny Calvo first hit the mats in middle school, and since then, it's been a heck of a ride for the father, Duaneus Sr. Calvo, the IIAG's 145-pound boys wrestling gold medalist, says wrestling requires quite a commitment both mentally and physically. So balancing academics and athletics, especially during senior year, when college is looming larger than life, requires drive and determination. I usually take time to reflect on past failures and just my goals. So that helps keep me focused for wrestling and also for SATs and school in general. Calvo went undefeated this year and has only one loss as a Friar upperclassman. In his junior year, he lost a match but redeemed himself by winning the gold at the All-Island Meet. In fact, he's medaled every year as an FD wrestler, even taking silver as a freshman after spending the year battling with a senior for a varsity spot. In his sophomore year, Calvo broke his finger but came back in time to grab a bronze at All-Island. The decorated wrestler says he'll continue to strive for excellence something he's done in his last four years as a friar, as an homage to his coaches when he hits the college wrestling circuit. Wrestling is a sport that really just requires so many skills and a lot of physical strength and refinement. So you gotta direct all of your, all of your energy, all your time, all your talent towards that if you wanna be successful. His older brother Nainoa turned him on to wrestling while he was in middle school, and the two shared the journey, something Calvo says was valuable because he was able to learn from his big brother's wins and losses. And once the two set their sights on becoming double I double AG wrestling royalty, there was no turning back. We just started to live it, you know. We started watching wrestling, paying attention to all the college and Olympic uh, competitions and tournaments and uh, it, it just consumed our lives, and we, we couldn't be more happy. Calvo closed out his four-year wrestling career on a historic note as the Friars won their second consecutive double I double AG boys wrestling title, going back to back as champs. And the icing on the cake? Calvo was able to wrestle on the same squad as his kid brother Matthias. Oh, well, it just helps make the moment even more memorable, even more special. Uh, I would really like to attribute it to all the wonderful parents, the fans, the coaches that continue to guide us and show us what's right and wrong and help keep us motivated, searching for that gold. Uh, you know, thanks to Coach Terry DeBold, Coach Jose Cruz, and all the other people, uh, we wouldn't be where we are today. So. And just where is Calvo today? Well, he's enjoying time with the family during the holidays, but he's also turned his eye to college apps. Of course, applying to Stanford where his brother made the wrestling team as a freshman, but he says he'll also apply at Tufts, Notre Dame, Santa Clara, and even Harvard. He says once he's in college, he'll consider himself a student first, but he'll shoot for the chance to stay golden on the mat at the next level. And with his focus and base keeping him on his feet, he's sure to face the challenges ahead with the same will to win he's had in his four years as a Friar wrestler. And that's what makes Leonard Calvo a game changer.